Hi and welcome to another episode of Mission Control. Today we're going to take a look at density, which flighties think is causing things to fall down. And the sky is blue because it reflects the color of the ocean? Nah, not really. But let's launch this mission and have a look at density and flat earth things. Density is a word for describing how much matter there is in a given volume. For example, if a 10 liter bucket can hold 50 tennis balls, the density is 5 balls per liter. If you squeeze the balls, which might hurt a little, you could probably fit 60 tennis balls in there. And then you have increased the density to 6 balls per liter. Some elements are denser than others, just like flatties are denser than normal people. And lead is more dense than carbon, which means that one cubic meter of lead holds more molecules than one cubic meter of carbon. Now that we have established the term density, let's have a look at why things fall down. The law of gravity says that mass attracts mass. So the giant mass of the Earth pulls on every single molecule. The more molecules, the greater the combined pull is. That's why the object on the left is heavier because it has more molecules for Earth to pull on. Notice that both objects have the same density. The gravity-denying flatties say that objects are moved up and down because of difference in density. If that was the case, then these objects should balance because they have the same density. That's why mass is the factor and not density. Same thing with velocity which is distance over time. It doesn't tell you anything about acceleration. So Flatties, you have yet to explain how density causes a different pull on the left side of these scales. Well, I believe that was another safe landing. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.